first. Howdy, welcome back to Transformers Defense of the Fallen War Room Wackiness. As you recall in the last episode, I showed you hordes of headless long hauls. And now we're gonna have some irony with Ironhide. Yes, I know it's a terrible pun, I don't care. Let's see what we got here. Starting off with Iron Away. Kind of hard to see him here. But he's a very lean looking Ironhide. Very lean. Kind of cool looking. Hmm. Alright. Pretty lean. He's alright. And here we have plain old Ironhide. Not much to him, so let's just go. Notch. What would you say? Nothing. That's what I thought. Iron Prime. I live to smash. Bold and strong looking Autobot. Pretty lean. Kind of cool looking. Ironhide's pretty cool when he's lean and not chunky. Ugh. <laughs> okay, next. Iron It. Nice. Big gun iron ratchet thing. Okay. Uh. Okay. Kind of similar to old Ironhide. A bit chunkier. We got some big guns there. All right, and now Iron B. Come to me. Oh my. I am Iron B. Okay. Um, is he? I do believe he's flipping us off. Do you really want to mess with me? Is he? I can't really tell. <sighs> okay. Yes, I think he might be. I have no idea. Check the back of him here. <laughs> He's pretty big. Uh, huh. Yeah, I can't tell if he's flipping this off. I think he is. All right, let's pull up Powered Up Optimus. Or Powered Up Iron Ironed Up Optimus? Ironed Up? I don't know. Powered up Iron I don't know. Hmm. Well, he's got a foot condition, that's for sure. I could do a lot with a pair of wings. Okay. As you probably know, I cannot fly. No wings. Interesting. Alright. Let's hit for the bots. Let's see what we have with the cons. First up, we have Iron Hall. Smash! He's got quite the shoulder condition. Otherwise, pretty much like Iron Hide himself. How lovely. Moving on. Iron Ore. Not to be confused with the one from Train Town. Pretty lean. A little too lean. It's like Ironhide got skinny. Eh, no matter. Moving on. <laughs> Iron Tron. Hmm. He's got some finger issues right there. <laughs> eh. These aren't the most grotesque ones, are they? Alright, next let's see Iron Scream. Okay. Okay. That's... <laughs> well, he's really disjointed. All messed up and... Starscape tends to have a lot of problems with his arms, doesn't he? Huh. And last but not least, Iron Ways. Oh, look, it's a... Wow. A Widow Ironhide with a face cage or face shield or something. He's so small. Look at him. He's so tiny. It's Widow Ironhide. Aww. Is it that precious? Alright. 
Okay, well that's all of those guys. Once again, I'll run through a few cutscenes and see what other humorous stuff we can come up with. Stay tuned, or something. Ironhide, is Ironhide cleared for duty? I have had a complete long haul. Ironhide! Ready for anything. Another hour in Shanghai and you'd have been ready for recycling. You'd be sheet metal by now. Hardly as useful as its present form. Well done, Autobots. Our combat times keep coming down. We're moving fast. And winning. That's what really matters. You have led us to victory. Sir, the enemy has fallen back. Both locations are secured and all personnel accounted for. And the boy, Ironhide, remains undiscovered. We have done well, Autobots. Ironhide! Don't give up so easily. Hate to hear you on a bad day, Ironhide. We've won for now, so enjoy it while you can. Hmm. We are achieving our battlefield goals, but not fully. We may come to regret this strategy. He's right. We must be more thorough. Our alliance with the humans grows stronger with each victory. Lord Ironhide, at last. Ironhide, you left me to die on that insect planet. Only to seek reinforcements, my lord. In your absence, someone had to take command. Even in death, there is no command but mine. Despite our victory, I am disappointed. And thus concludes another episode of War Room Wackiness. Post in the comments which one was your favorite. Next up is going to be... Grindor. Interesting to see how he turns out. All in all, none of these Iron Heads were extremely impressive, but I probably say my favorite is Iron B because... Well, either Iron B or Iron Ways, but... Eh. Alright, well that's it for this episode. I'll see you in the next one where we try out Grindor. Later.